Hey guys, this is Backhand. This is Lousy. And this is We've Been Drink- Drinking MMA. Appreciate you guys listening to the show. Uh, this is going to be our predictions for our locks and parlays of the of the night. Um, so my lock is going to be Du Ho Choi. I believe he will get it done versus Kyle Nelson. And um, and then oh, and then my parlay is going to be Du Ho Choi, um, y- Jung, and um, and then. Uh, my third, my third one's gonna be uh, Kinoshita. Those are great picks. Yeah. Uh, this is lousy here. Our lock of the night is in the distance between uh, Fujit and Kinoshita. Uh, Manny Bohm, who's fighting um, on the prelim, and uh, Choi. That is my parlay, and my lock is in the distance Fujit Kinoshita. So, so the Kinoshita fight, the Kinoshita, uh, Yosuku uh, Kinoshita versus uh, Fujit, Adam Fujit. It's an interesting fight because Fujit has no knockout power and Kinoshita has plenty of knockout power, yeah. right? So that's why we're thinking it's, uh, I mean, it makes sense. Uh, I, mean, I like your I like your pick that it's going to go inside the distance. It's going gonna, it's gonna to end. Somebody's getting knocked out. <laughs> yeah. I don't know who it is. I th- I'm pretty damn sure Kinoshita is going to knock the hell out yeah. of Fujit, right? <laughs> I mean, <laughs> if you look at his uh, record, yeah. he either knocks people out or gets knocked out. Yeah. It's one of the two. Yep. It's not decision. It's For not sure. submission. He's getting knocked out. And did you have Choi on your parlay as well? That is correct. Dude, Choi is, he's my lock and he's in my parlay as well. And so, Dude, Choi is one of these guys, superstar fighter. He really has everything. His timing is excellent. Counters are excellent. Kicks, distance, uh, you know, he, he, he does get a little bit slightly over aggressive sometimes, just a little bit sometimes, yeah. but he does it to at least set up punches. He doesn't yeah. just put his head in just like a moron. Um, he sets himself up for the big shots. When yes. He does move forward, mm-hmm. but like, he has good defense as far as staying at bay while the other yes. guys. He knows how to like go side to side or back. Mm-hmm. Yeah, he knows what he's doing as far as. Doesn't it feel like he has so many different styles within him? Yeah. It feels like he can sit, sit back and counter. It feels like he can go to the side and get you at the yeah. angle. It feels like he can do a lot of he's different things. Same with his uh, power punches. Yeah. Just I feel I feel like if, he, if if his coaches told him to just hold back a little bit and, and and don't put on so much of a show and go forward all the time, I think he could win more fights if he just decided to win by decision more often. He likes to put on a show and really, yeah. really, he's exciting. I mean, he can fight any way he wants against Kyle Nelson. I just don't <laughs> think Kyle Nelson yeah. would have, I just don't think he has enough power to do anything like real special against Joe. Doesn't have the power in his counters, just has the kicks, right? Those little calf yeah. kicks. And and Choi's Cho- Cho- Cho the pick, for sure. Choi's the pick, man. Yeah. Cho- Cho- Choi's a guy who looks like a top 10 guy, and, and Kyle Nelson looks like, again, just doesn't look that great. And then, um, who's, your, who's your third guy again? Uh, Manny Bond, yeah. he is fighting G Young Kim. Mm-hmm. Um, G has uh, fought three times in the last four years. Mm-hmm. All of them have been losses. Wow. Okay. So uh, at the great Manny Manny Bomb is just on the way up, I think. Awesome. And, uh, so I think she's gonna win this fight. Yep. So Manny Manny Bomb, mm-hmm. Troy, and uh, my lock pick. Which is in the distance of Fujit. Yep. Now I had Kinoshita winning, but I think he's going to KO uh, Fujit. I think uh, Duho Choi is going to win, beat Nelson really easily. And then, of course, my third one was uh, Jung versus Clark. I like Jung. Jung has just more active than Clark, and Clark is a little bit more susceptible to getting hit. They're both big guys, though, um, and they don't move move that well. So it's going to be uh, it's going to be a fun fight night, guys. Uh, good matchups, I would say, right? Yeah, there's, well, some, there's some good fights in here. Yeah, it's like mirror. Some of them are mirror images. Some of them are mismatches, like the Duho Shoi Nelson fight and the Kinoshita Fuji fight. And then you know, so it's kind of interesting. And the main event is one of those fights where it's like, man, the young lion versus the old lion. Yeah. How many times do we have to say the young lion? Well, yeah, yeah. young lion's gonna win. <laughs> so there you go, guys. Uh, those these are our picks again, and we're gonna uh, rattle them off again. Um, my lock of the night is going to be um, uh, Duho Choi, and then my parlays are gonna be Duho Choi, uh, Yasuka Kinoshita, uh, probably by KO, and then um, uh, Jung to beat Clark. And my picks are my lock of the night is in the distance. Between Fuji and Kinoshita. Mm-hmm, someone's getting KO'd. Uh, someone's getting KO'd now, for sure. Uh, Choi yep. is going to win. Do Ho Choi the Superstar. And uh, Manny Bone. Manny that, Bone. That is my parlay. Beautiful, beautiful. Awesome, guys. Appreciate you guys listening. Uh, this was uh, We've Been Drinking MMA, and uh, we'll be uh, 
doing a, uh, every 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 time every fight every fight card we're gonna be doing predictions, man. Uh, so we're gonna be doing the uh, Volkanovski uh, Makachev fight for next week. That's a very exciting one, guys. Yeah, so stay uh, stay tuned for that one. We're gonna yeah, be dro- we're gonna be dropping that cool. we're dropping it uh, the the day after this fight on Sunday. So yeah. watch out for that, guys. Appreciate yeah. you guys listening. Thanks again, guys.